While competing for national championships year after year and maintaining a high level of play with major league prospects, many pose the question, when will UT baseball make that jump from Division II to Division I? Here at Spectrum Field in Clearwater, Florida, home of Philadelphia Phillies spring training, this past February, UT baseball took on the fight and fills in an exhibition matchup. Despite holding the Spartans to zero runs, the big leaguers had nothing but praise for the Division II program. Well, this show is clear that they have talent to compete, I think, at any level in collegiate baseball. So they have, they have some talent out there, and, you know, whatever happens, happens. But, I mean, they have a good team and a lot of good arms. The team was aggressive, you know, and they... They came at hitters, they threw strikes, they seemed like they com good, good competitive natures. UT Baseball currently resides in first place atop the Sunshine State Conference. Senior home run leader Harrison Bragg seems to be more than content with his current competition. Our pitching staff is absolutely amazing and they shove it every night. But um, just other pitchers in the league, they're probably not as good as our pitchers. So the next level, you kind of have to adjust to that more quickly than you would here. With 85 MLB draft selections in the program's history, a shot at the bigs is more likely than a jump in divisions for the Spartans. You can't just take one sport, Division One. We have to move the entire athletic program. Uh, we, it would cost a significant amount of money, one, but there'd be a lot of other things that we would have to do. UT Baseball has shown they have the talent to compete against Major League prospects, but only time will tell when they could take that talent to the Division One level. Mark Franklin, UT TV, Spartan News.